Oh, that's a big boy. Armor troll. This mine could be hiding a secret. Anrock and his loyalists. No sign of Lodgok out here. He must be inside already. I wonder what has happened. Is Lord God going to betray us, or is there something else going on here? A bit thrilled about this. Or well, well, the game developers try to make more drama that is he going to uh, stand with the goblins or with the wizard kind, which he despises. Look at the size of this mine. Lord Gork, where Something are you? Something seems wrong. This place is teeming with Ranrock's loyalists. I have to keep my wits about me. This cart ought to get me deeper into the mine. Why is Dracus no talus? Momentum more in, in my my build this here. Kringons, but I'm in the driver's seat this time. Ah. Something seems wrong. How deep will this take? Red Rob's gonna be pleased with our progress. Who was on that car? Oh, no. I'm with his car, will ya? That has to be the end up ahead. Good bring up. Working. I wonder where these pipes go. Akio. Okay, it's some kind of boss. I miss.
Okay, this is elevator. Good bridge. That's a big boy over there. Probably I can't change that guy into a barrel. But we could actually try to reduce the... Even the odds a bit. Should think they felt that in London. <laughs> Rebellio. Door troll bogies. Okay, now we can actually loot this place. Another drill is complete. The wizarding world will crumble. <laughs> <laughs> I can end this right now. I have to destroy the drill and stop Round Rock's loyalists. Apparently, <laughs> the oh, plan like changes. Plan changes. Yeah. 
One less follower, Ranrock. Confirm. Ah, there's the one shoot. So one support. Last, last one. I don't know if this is safe, but works. You. That's me. That. Is unfortunate. No matter, we will build another. I found this one lurking outside. Lord Gok, come to make amends, little brother. A br little brother? I came to stop this. What is this you've brought me? Okay. So he has some powers. Are you all right? I'll never understand you, Lord Gok. So, Gollum, that witch did not consider you an equal. She, like all wizard kind, sought only to use you. You're wrong, Ranrock. The young ones are especially deceitful. They are taught to hide their disgust for us as they exploit us. Astonishing that our ancestors ever trusted each other. All this time, looking everywhere for the final repository, searching in vain for Bragbor's last journal. Wasted my time chasing a child. And my little brother knew where it was all along. But now, I don't need you. I don't need any of you! I was bringing it to you. You are a traitor to our kind! No! Above the Uh, okay. And he missed. Of course he missed. Tried so hard to reason with him. So don't go is dead. It wasn't now to get out of this clear, place. clearly shown, but then again this is Peggy Fell game, so you can you can't really show anything in detail. Or or even even in uh, in, in fictional detail. Yeah, Peggy uh, ratings have Traditionally, given even uh, even from the heavy implications, they have been, they have been giving edge ratings. But then again, I don't know. Things change, and I would like to see more more about games that are just Peggy well, and and this this good and this wide. Because th this definitely is, is an open world game. I ask, actually asked from the teens that, and they thought this this was like 16. But no. I mean, I'll send I... word to Fig to meet me in the map chamber. He and the keepers need to know Ranrock has that journal and knows where the final repository is. So let's throw these, these away. Check through the room and...
I wonder where this goes. Hopefully outside. Uh, maybe... No, I don't think it is. Let's go other way around. Is everything all right? Oh, bless you. Oh, thank you for asking. I'm Betty. Betty Bugbrook. Weird name. Everything is not all right. It's my dear friend Hazel. Oh, she's in trouble. Hazel? Yes. Oh, she's a unicorn. Known her for years. Uh -huh. She doesn't like to leave the forest, so I visit her once a week to brush out her mane and bring her some treats. Her coat is glorious. Well, the last time I saw her, we were violently attacked by a pack of wolves. All right. Hazel, loyal friend that she is, leapt in front to protect me, and in the process, I fear she may have been injured. I'm sorry to hear that. I want to help her, but she seems to have gone into hiding. Out of fear, I'd imagine. I know you Hogwarts students learn a fair bit about caring for beasts. Perhaps you could find my unicorn friend and get her somewhere safe so that she can heal. How did you become so close with the unicorn? It was luck, truly. I came across her when she was a little golden foal. Didn't even have a horn yet. Oh, she trusted me straight away. We'd play together for hours. Oh. I do hope she'll be all right. Unicorn hair is a valuable wand core, and I suppose losing a hair or two mightn't hurt her. But I'm terrified those poachers will want her for her blood to keep themselves alive. <gasps> and that is more than I can bear to so, think of. So, wolves or poachers? I'll keep an eye out for your unicorn friend and take her to safety if I see her. Oh, you've a good soul. I can always tell. Please, don't risk your own safety, though. I don't know precisely where she is, but I can tell you that her den is north of Hogsmeade. And although I haven't been able to brush her lately, I imagine she still has the brightest, most beautiful coat of her entire herd. Anne's worried. She said Sebastian promised her that I would be there if she went to meet him in the catacomb. But now he's asking her to join him immediately and to come alone she says he doesn't sound himself uh, okay meet us at the catacomb as soon as you can well i hope that my quill has conveyed my message clearly that doesn't sound good mm. well if we're talking beasts but... hazel must be here somewhere So we are at the rescue once again. Of course she ran away because I kinda kind of landed on top of her top of her. That's a unicorn. I could actually train my unicorn catching catching skills with this. Oh no! I'll look after you. 
So one stopping stopping doesn't one stoppage isn't enough. Come on, I can take Hazel back to a vivarium now. I should let Madam Bugbrook know she's safe. You that. can feed a beast, or it can feed you, if you get my meaning. Now I probably need those wolf pelts more for my potions. Rebellion. So when we when we see those. Can't still pass any cat. Madam Bugbrook, I found your unicorn friend, Hazel. Oh, what a relief! Is she all right? Are you all right? Do you have a safe place for her to stay? Yes. We're both fine. And I have a safe place for her at Hogwarts. You have a kind heart, you do. I'm relieved and thankful that you'll take care of her. I shall miss my sweet pointy pony, but I know she's safer away from the poachers. Do give her a nice brushing for me, won't you? I wonder if I'm safe to explore in there. Sebastian has gone too far. You saw what lies in the catacomb. I cannot stay here. Wait, Anne, please. Ominous. Willing to put Lumos. the whole hamlet and himself in danger on the chance that some old relic could help to heal me. I'm sorry, Ominous. Make sure he's all right, will you? I'm glad you're here. I received your owl. Where's Sebastian? Inside the catacomb. Frankly, I was surprised you weren't with him. Ominous, I... Stop. You swore you wouldn't let Sebastian take this one step further. Yet here we are. He won't listen to reason. I should have stopped him before. Sebastian's in real trouble now. I'm going back into the catacomb to find him. Anne's right. He and the entire hamlet are in danger. The place is crawling with Inferi. Inferi? What are you talking about? You'll see. We need to hurry. Sebastian must not be in his right mind. Probably not. Oh. 
Last time we were here, this place was crawling with spiders. We're about to face worse. Let's find Sebastian quickly. Revelio. Accio. Where was Sebastian when you and Am found him? Just ahead, in the great room. Oh no. Confringo! Accio! Confringo! Expelliarmus! Accio! Stench of the dead. I suppose I have some use for this. So, where is the? There weren't this many in theory before. And there's no sign of Sebastian. Confringo! Accio! Confringo! Okay, this is this is the phase where I didn't want to go. Hold on a moment. I was so worried about Sebastian, I didn't even realize. Anne's gone to get Solomon. Who? When she first saw the Inferi, she thought Sebastian was being attacked. But then he showed her the relic and said he'd learned how to use it. Carvings uh... on the relic were Inferi, and Sebastian somehow created them. Not exactly. He's controlling them. This is powerful dark magic. Creating in theory is incredibly difficult, but controlling them, as Anne and I frantically barricaded the inferior to keep them from escaping, Sebastian kept mumbling about healing Anne. When Anne said she couldn't stay here, I didn't realize what she meant. Solomon threatened to go to the headmaster if he heard of Sebastian dealing with dark magic. I need to get to Hogwarts. I must get to Professor Black first. Twist the story a bit, make him think it's a family fight. I'll be back as soon as I can. See if you can talk some sense into Sebastian. Be careful. Well, that, that, that's a plan. Okay, now we are alone. Confringo! How many of them are there? Accio! Expelliarmus!
Facebook. Hela helpa helpa twit helpa twitter blog. Now, now I just need to start learning learning to blog. Okay, where's the Sebastian? These inferiors seem far from controlled. Changing the inferi to the um, form of the explosive barrel is only damaging to others, not not the inferi itself. So it, it's kind of having full full HP. Okay, this, this place is already visited. I wonder where the, where the Sebastian is. So if we return here. Can bring up. Akio. This looks suitable shoot up like bloomy place. Okay, here, here he is. Akio. Whole family hobby necromancy. Sebastian. What are you doing here? Isn't this incredible? Uh, no. Oh. Sebastian, I told you, the relic is the answer. I've been trying to reverse the dark magic that injured Anne, but this will allow me to control it, just as I can control the Inferi. Control? I had to fight the Inferi all the way. Okay. That's Solomon came. Accio relic. The relic. So what did, did he do, do, do? Okay, that's not a good thing. You'll pay for this. <laughs> Oh no, this is kind of, kind of three-way here. One thing that guy is actually former... Form, form, former <laughs> enforcer of the magic set. And now he's getting his ass, ass kicked by a student. Stupid one. Oh, Akio. Oh, 
Throw him around a bit. He cannot be healed, Sebastian. You must stop. Uh, I won't let her suffer. Avada Kedavra. Uh, bab, 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 um, not good. Oh, and okay, she, she can, she can operate. What have you done? I must get out of here. Well, this went dark. I can't let him leave. Sebastian, wait! Arresto momentum. Stop, Sebastian. Now hold on. Arrest the momentum. What is it? Well, you kind of killed your foster father. Why wouldn't you stop? I was calling after you. Anne won't survive this. She's withering away, inside and out. Solomon's never been there for us, not really. He gave up on Anne. I'll never give up on her. You saw him, didn't you? He was going to ruin her life. He attacked us. I. I had to use the killing curse. You know I did. If I hadn't known how to cast it.
You went too far, Sebastian. I... I can't think right now. I need to leave. I can't stay here. I need to find Ominous. Sebastian. Please, I'm not myself right now. Let's meet later at the Undercroft, all right? Well, this went dark. She's devastated. She just buried your uncle alone. I did it for her. Sebastian, Anne can't bear the thought of turning you in, but... What? Turn me in? She saw what happened. I'll give yeah. you some time to think, Sebastian. Turn me in. Sebastian. Did you hear that? You saw what happened. I never wanted to hurt my uncle. I know. That's I can't believe he's not gone. entirely true. How did things go so wrong? Curses, curses work because you want to... to do it. Oh, and I was only trying to help. I can't leave now. Anne needs me more than ever. You understand. You can talk to Ominous. Make him understand. He listens to you. I need to be with Anne. Considering what I said, that there's not many choices that actually matter, because this guy hasn't really decent anything. I don't know what to do, Sebastian. You don't know. You do know. Anne has no one. Yeah, because I you kind of murdered one. I did. I know what I did was wrong. Well, that's good. I only good. hope she can forgive me. That everyone can forgive me. Um, not everyone. No matter what happens from here, I'm glad we met. Revelio, oh, Sebastian. Ominous? What a mess. I can't believe it. After I last saw you, I went straight to Hogwarts. Before I had time to talk to Black, I heard from Anne. I rushed to Feldcroft and found her with Solomon's body. She was beside herself with grief. Part of her wants Sebastian to face the consequences, another part can't bear the thought of it. I don't want to lose Sebastian, but... I don't think we have a choice. Okay. This might be a choice that actually matters. So, in the end, shall we turn Sebastian in? Well, he murdered, killed uh, his foster father with an unforgivable curse. So, that's Azkaban for him. And we remember what kind of place Azkaban is. And we would deprive uh, Anne for her brother. So I think, I think, in light of cir circumstances, this is the only choice I, I can actually make. We do have a choice. What good will it do to turn him in now? He clearly regrets everything. He's not going to do anything like this again. We've both heard that before. But we also need to think about Anne. She's lost her health. Now she's lost her uncle. Do you really want to take her brother away from her too? Point. I, I understand what you're saying. Perhaps you're right. As much as I believe that Sebastian should pay for his actions, we'd only be punishing Anne as well. I hope we're doing the right thing. I'll talk to Anne. If it comes from me, she'll agree with this decision. Thank you, Ominous. You're a good friend. Whatever lies ahead, we must face it together. That I know. It's it's pretty okay that it's actually Gaunt, that uh, Gaunt family member, that it's like good good guy in this story. 
if, even if, if he has like evil name. 